In this video demonstration, I'm going to show you how to create connection to Zoho Sheet service and import data into SQL Server table using Cozerox REST components. Run Visual Studio under Administrator account and create a new integration services project. Click on Data Fault tab and click here to add a new Data Fault task. From left side panel, scroll down and drag and drop resource component on canvas. Double click on it and click new to create connection to Zoho Sheet service. From configuration drop down menu, scroll down and select Zoho Sheet and click New to provide your credentials and generate access token file. Click Verify, Trust, and Accept. Here we have generated access token, which I'm going to save. And create a password for it. Click OK. We are ready to test our connection. Test connection succeed. Click OK. From Resources drop-down menu, select Worksheet Data. From Resource ID drop-down, select Contacts List. For Worksheet ID drop-down, select Sheet 1. Here is the Contacts List, here is Sheet 1. Click on Columns tab to see available columns. For this demonstration I'm going to use just a few of them. And click on Preview tab for Data Preview. We have 5 records. In Zoho Sheet we have 5 records as well. Click OK. Scroll down and drag and drop all of the B destination component on canvas. Double click on it to configure your database connection. And click OK. Select source component and drag the blue arrow connecting source with destination. Double click on destination component, mapping tab to map source with destination columns. Click OK. Before to execute the package, let's see what do we have. We have five records in Zoho Sheet, which we are going to import into SQL Server table using Cozerox REST components. We are ready to execute the package. Package execution is successful. Thank you for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel.